Hey fellow Vault Wearers, it's Angry Turtle coming back with another video, this time in response to Inof Survivalist video, because because she did some amazing investigative work in regards to Speed Demon and Empath bugs, features, however you call it with Bethesda, then big shout out to her for all this work. I, since her video, I couldn't think about anything else. In the same time, I would like to apologize for my comment that I put under her video because it was not correct. I put edit now that this comment is not correct. I spent hours upon hours trying to actually get into the bottom of this problem as it happened to be much more complicated than I assumed and I apologize for that but I got all the answers I think so okay maybe I shouldn't call it all the answer but I think I got all the answers then let's get into it if you didn't watch yet enough survivalist video I do recommend you watching it it's uh, some amazing testing is done in that video that you can watch. And now I'm going over like answers. I will not go over all the possible testing I did. I will just mention I did testing uh, on NPC in PVP scenario. And it seems that it's uh, very similar regardless. Therefore, I will be using Crusader pistol with cryo receiver to demonstrate the problems here as I don't have any cryo resistance. And at this moment, just to give you a quick heads up, I unequip every type of perk, every type of legendary perk, and I don't have any mutations. I was testing with mutations and you can see the effects of serum are still here, but no, no active mutations, no addictions, no, like nothing. I, I, I'm naked, nothing. And now let's start step by step because this stuff is freaking complicated. Then. Let me demonstrate how much damage I will take by myself after I shoot myself. And you can see it's 35 damage. Now I will create a team. Casual one. It doesn't really matter which one it will be. But I want to really do similar scenario that Enoch had. Then it's casual and we'll shoot the ground again. And it's again about 35 damage. Just round it up that it will be 34, 35, but it's a rounding error. It's again 35 damage. Then nothing really changed. Let me heal. Now, just a quick info. After testing, Empath, if I will use it, will not work on myself even when I'm on the team. That was incorrect. And I want to say it first because that was incorrect. It only works on teammates, but it's even more complicated than that. In case of teammates, we'll go over that. And then we have Speed Demon Serum that contains a hidden empath effect for your teammates that can stack with regular empath. Now I'm joined by my other character with just one mutation with Speed Demon. And let's shoot the ground. And you can see the damage taken is only 20 now. Then that's a huge difference. That's like... Close to 50% damage reduction. Imagine that, Speed Demon itself. And it doesn't stack if you have more teammates with Speed Demon. It doesn't change anything. It can be one or more. You need at least one teammate with Speed Demon to have this bonus. Now I'm joined by a character with Speed Demon and Empath. And again, we shoot the ground. And I'm taking 16 points of damage per shot. But... That's not everything. I can cut it even more. Uh, if you watch enough video at this point, she said that third teammate can boost your resistance. It's not as simple, but it does require at least three teammates to get this damage reduction even farther. And now I'm joined by another character without any mutations whatsoever. Clean slate, then I'm a clean slate. I have a teammate with Empath and Speed Demon and another teammate with Clean Slate. And I'm shooting the ground again. Look at that. Just 9 points of damage. We went down from 35 points of damage to 9 just by a team setup. And how it's happening, I will show you exactly what will happen when my Clean Slate teammate will get Empath Mutation. Okay, my other teammate just ate Empath Serum, therefore now I have Clean Slate 
I have teammate with Empath and Speed Demon, and another teammate with Empath. Then two Empath teammates and me without any muta without anything. I, I don't have anything. I'm naked. No perks, nothing. I shoot once. You can see, again, I'm back to taking 16 points of damage. How it's happening? I was testing on four person team as well, and it looked like you need to maximize your damage reduction for whatever crazy reason. You need teammates with speed demon, doesn't matter how many, can be all teammates with speed demon or just one. You need one teammate with empath and at least one teammate without empath. That's crazy, like you would think more empaths better. No, you can have more empaths, but at least one of your teammates need to be without empath. And what's even more crazy, your mutations on your character actually doesn't matter for that. And of course, all those resistances that you can obtain stuck with all other damage reductions that you can get. And now I'm back to perfect team setup. Just a reminder, one teammate with Empath and Speed Demon and another teammate without Empath. As well, I entered Power Armor. Then previously I was taking nine damage without any reduction. If you don't know, Power Armor offers percentage reduction equal to 42%. Now if I shoot something, my health 256, I shoot 254. Again, 252. I'm taking only two damage at this point. And if I drop my health to get into emergency protocols range for additional 50% damage reduction. Okay, my health 37. I shoot 36. Shoot 35. Shot 34. 33. 32. I'm taking only one damage per shot. Then we went down from 35 damage taken per shot to one. Uh, you can calculate the percentage, but that's basically like almost immunity to all damage. And finally, for the last test, I applied basically like all the mutations available to myself from the serums. And I would like to mention here that I don't know what's the reason, but Empath even applied from the serum will not have negative effects suppressed. I don't know from when it's happening. But as you can see, all other mutations have only positive. Empath have positive and negative. Regardless, it's meant for me at this moment, I have only the penalty, no positives. So you can see when I start shooting, I have 35 health, shoot 33, 31. You can see I'm taking two damage, sometimes one. Then closer to two damage now because of this penalty and all other mutations didn't affect anything else. I just have this penalty for myself from Empath and I really don't know how long Empath is bugged in this regard. I'm pretty sure it was working in the past, although I will not give my head for that. In the same time, I would just quickly like to let you know that in case on Empath and your damage reduction, as well, I don't know how long this is bugged, but trenching numbers doesn't do anything, even though it will show on your mutation tab statistics. If you have it equipped or your teammate have it equipped, it doesn't affect empath damage reduction in any way at all. And the same applies to class freak. It will show on your card, on your stat tab, but it will do nothing again in case of empath. Those perks working perfectly fine or other mutations, but Empath seems to be immune, like not affected by anything. Then that's everything you need to know. I hope you catch it. If not, I will just quickly repeat it to get the maximum damage mitigation at this moment for whatever crazy reason. It's probably some bugs, but it doesn't matter what kind of mutations you have, but you need at least one teammate with Empath and Speed Demon, plus at least one teammate without Empath. Plus perks like Strange in Numbers and Class Freak doesn't affect this damage mitigation at all. I hope it will be helpful for you. If you still have any questions, I will try to answer them in comment section. One more time, thank you to In of Survivalist for figuring out that there is issue with this stuff and making a testing. And I follow up with even more testing because there was like, I couldn't let it go. Like if I don't understand how something is bugged, how is it working? I need to crack it. And I hope 
I did everything right in here. If your experience is different as well, let me know. Thank you as well to Mad Dog Grot for catching me out when I commented under in a video that I was incorrect. Thank you for that. I always appreciate guys if you call me out when I make a mistake. And as well, one more thanks to Robo Dragon that helped me with testing. He was my fourth teammate. He's not here anymore, but he was with me earlier to test out if it makes any difference when you have four teammates. Then that's everything for this video. As always, thank you a lot for watching and see you all in the next one.